um, a company section so you, you can get a great snapshot of the innovation by the, the biggest uh, companies in China what, what, they're, what they're doing already. DJI, the world's largest drone company in the world. Um, I'm sure you're familiar with ByteDance now. Cato, the world's largest electric battery maker. Um, See, so yeah, Alibaba is about way more than just e commerce, doing you know, AI, smart cities, um, blockchain robotics, uh, AR, VR drones, uh, same with Jim Dong, uh, Baidu, um, not just search engines. Autonomous, uh, autonomous vehicles, smart cities, the world's first AI city, Xi'an. You can see how BYD has become the world's biggest electric car company. And eHarmony has the world's first civil passenger. Um, with the autonomous drone license and Xpeng, as you saw in the video, has, has developed the world's first flying car. Now, also a two in one electric car and passenger drone model. There'll be a video on, I believe, on the drones page that, that shows how the drone um, uh, is released and how to do the boot of the car. Um, this is some great videos of the innovation that's already going on. I definitely want to be watching these chip videos um, from Huawei um, because that 90% global market share of NVIDIA is, is going to rapidly shrink as Huawei's uh, chips are beginning to be exported around the world. Digital Silk Road, they're going to be they're faster and they're going to be cheaper, and they have I see I see some great stuff on um, also humanoid robots. Hi, nice to meet you. Chinese robot maker Unity Robotics is taking the world by storm after its dancing robots shouting to public limelight. We managed to visit its headquarters in Hangzhou, East China to learn more about this company and its striking innovations. Well, it's pretty hard to imagine this regular low-key. It's its The robotic dogs on one end serve for business requirements such as safety inspections, and on the other end, they can be great companions for performance. Through my entire life, I can never do that. It can actually do way more than me, like this. Uh, really extraordinary um, innovation already being done uh, in humanoid robots, and this is the real future of of AI um, and this, the smart cities um, of uh, Xi'an, for example. Um, it's not generative AI, so don't get stuck, trapped, fixated on 
deep sleep and chat GPT, this is what the American mainstream media want to get to get um, bogged down with a much bigger reality that um, China is, is at the forefront of this now. And you can see um, Abby, Abby Barbas uh, for the same same page. Um, a little bit about Alibaba's own journey to where I am now. But, you know, autonomous, autonomous guided uh, vehicles, um, AI um, supermarkets, um, AI hotels, no, no, no check in. So we, we can see um, we can see some of um, <clears throat> Alibaba's um, smart warehouses, uh, tiny out autonomous guided uh, vehicles. Extraordinary. Um, running, running all the uh, operations um, with, a, with with packaging, distribution, um, all the logistical operations um, to then to then go out to be be delivered. Um, they got um, autonomous vehicles delivering those those. Uh, parcels also. Yeah. Let's just move on to Baidu. Let's see Baidu a lot on the autonomous vehicles and, and the smart cities, uh, augmented reality, a little bit on, on early bird, just just to show everyone that you know China had a, had their own alternatives to Chat GPT before Deep Sleep. Uh, two years before Robo Taxis, uh, they, they got a fleet of four hundred already operating in China. No driving. Um, so some great um, videos on on Baidu's really globally pioneering development. Autonomous vehicles and uh, robo taxis, driverless cars. Um, Xi'an, obviously, the world's first AI city. Um, you know, the metaverse. Um, and there, there you go, you can see. Um, any bot superior to chat GPT, um, far, far before deep sea anyways in the last few years, but the mainstream media has very um, carefully in the Western world overlooked this. Um, so just watch this this video here on um, by these robo taxis in um, Beijing. Uh, 
，用户通过龙快跑 APP 打到车辆后，可以在车辆的后门的屏幕上输入手机的后四位尾号来开启车辆，然后开始享受自动驾驶出行服务。自动驾驶启动完成，请全程系好安全带，祝您行程愉快。您可以点击屏幕右下方第一个按钮，调整温度和风量。如果您是 ，see this is a April 2023 by the already、um, offer、uh, drive driverless taxis for for people to、uh, begin to start taking in in Beijing and just just to reinforce how.、Um, How far ahead really China is in、um, autonomous vehicles now than than, than America. You, you, you can see、uh, how Huawei is leading five G, five point five G now, and even six G now.、Um, Huawei has developed.、Um, Uh, the world's first 6G chip、uh, of five nanometer width, in collaboration with、uh, Smith uh, Semiconductor Manufacturing Industrial Corporation, the world's first foldable phone,、uh, smart uh, autonomous uh, driving. The world's first trifoldable phone too. It's pretty, pretty remarkable. And the airdrop、uh, features is really quite,、uh, quite, quite something. Pretty, uh, pretty incredible. And Huawei's just released、uh, its first phone with its own. Completely run on its own operating system,、um, Harmony OS. So this is a massive breakthrough for China, and this is a big problem for Apple and Google、um, and the iOS around the digital Silk Road. And.、Uh, See Jin Jin Dong,、uh, Jin Dong doing drone deliveries.、Um, I mean, even years before COVID, and、uh, Tech Tencent.、Um, you know, it's not just you know, it, for WeChat. It's building, as mentioned earlier, the、uh, Net City, one point two billion dollar. Uh, it's an AI healthcare、um, autonomous、uh, buses, but this this is we've got Apple Pay in the West, and China's got Pay with your with your the palm of your hand. <laughs> So 
think again. I mean, yeah. America can say it's, it's in the lead for AI, but the reality is that the real pioneering breakthroughs are, are already being adopted in Chinese society. And uh, 